the boy, we ain't talked about rainbow hair in a while. Over to Kashi 6 9 You know that they saying it's a great chance that um he faked that kidnapping. That happened to him. But not surprised. That he did it for clout and that because he was going to have an album coming out yeah and i think they were saying like what i seen it i heard it on the radio and then i seen it on the internet and they was like i think they were saying his attorney said that and i'm like wait a minute your attorney was supposed to be coming out and saying that like this and that but they were like yo that call that post got kidnapped and stuff it was wired because they were watching him and his people yeah so the police basically know that yo that was fake yeah and it was like Really? It did yeah. what y'all rappers out here doing today? Yeah, a lot of them are clout chasing. And then I remember at the time. And when did this start? Nah, they've been going on for a few years. But I remember when he first said he had got kidnapped. It was other people who said that it was uh, yeah, I think funny I at that. the time. Uh, old man Ebro, he was saying that, man, it was something about this story. It's it fishy. It don't seem right to me. And... A lot of the stuff with that dude, with Takashi, a lot of it was fake. Like, he never really was a game banger like that. They were just selling this image because they were working for him. Mm -hmm. And the record label, and that's why I said, like, people are talking about him as, you know, all of the heat is coming down on Takashi. But I think the record company, they have a role in this, too, because they were pushing him to do these things and allowing him to do these things because they felt like it was going to make them more money. They're going to deny plausible, what is it? Plausible something. Plausible deniability or some shit like that. Yeah, but that's, and so I was not surprised at all that people are saying that they're kidnapping is fake. And now I was like, really? but then once that, once I heard and I was like, no, that's, that's some shit he would do because he was doing a whole bunch of shit for clout, but people... Let and, him get away with it. Yeah, people was eating it up, though. You know, people was eating it up. They thought, like, you know, and they didn't know it was fake, they, but they was eating it up. They think they cool mm -hmm. and shit like that. But now it's all coming out that, yeah, all of the shit that he was doing was fake, man. All of it was. I don't know what's going to happen to him if he did get out. And that was funny. I thought he supposed to be getting no. I ain't hear it. after that. Yeah. This is the new thing. That, hey, yeah, he faked that. I thought he supposed to be. He think, caught the plea deal and everything. And he think he ready to come out. And I think you know. I think he if he get out, I still think he can come out and still have a rap career because I don't think his fans really give a shit. True. Like not, I said, hip hop is not the way that it used to be. People just now care about the music. You can be as fake as hell, and people wouldn't give a damn. They just want the music. Yeah, and like I told you before, I thought the people would have stopped listening to the Amigo after the Amigos came out and said that, yo, them guns and in, in our music video, they were just props and stuff. We don't really do that type of, we don't live that type of life in it. Like, no, I didn't. I didn't. It, I, I didn't. Uh -huh. it, it's, it's, it's a change. It's a change now, man, in hip-hop. Like, you can get away with every single thing in hip-hop now. I said, you hear the OGs. OGs, the old school hip hop listeners, they still hold these young cats accountable to it. But the young people, nah, they like, oh. hey man, we got the music, baby. That's all we caring about is the music. Probably also why they like, and uh -uh, we ain't getting into that. We ain't trying to bump to it because we know them dudes out there are faking it. And if that, that my thing is, is this, I don't have a problem with you know them cats and do whatever they want. Yeah. But my problem that I do have with it is when you pushing it so much. That you acting like you in the streets, but there's some real street dudes out here. Mm -hmm. There's some real street dudes out here, and you start coming in contact with them street dudes, and you pretending, and them dude lights your ass up, it gonna be a problem. And see, this is the thing with Takashi when he was rolling with the game members that he was rolling with, and he really wasn't a game member, but them cats was in there doing things in his name, and that's why you see him now in all of this trouble. When he really wasn't a gangster to begin with, but he was rolling with him to try to amp his career up and using them dudes. But then when the shit falls down, you gonna go down with it. Mm -hmm. But that's the end of that. Y'all hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Let us know what you think about this Takashi situation. Are you having fun laughing at it?
Are you sad? Are you rooting for him? I want to know.